Today on Beer Geek Nation, doing something a little bit special in the pumpkin beer department, something I've never had. This is from Almanac Brewing. This is their Heirloom Pumpkin Barley Wine, coming in at 12% alcohol by volume, and I gotta read the details on this one. 50% ale aged in with pumpkins aged in brandy barrels, blended with 50% ale brewed with pumpkin pie spices. So a very, very interesting concept. You know, Almanac doing some really cool stuff. They're doing a kind of a farm to bottle kind of concept. They're doing some great barrel aging stuff, some blending stuff. So looking forward to this one. I've got a lot of recommendations to, you know, review this one. I've never had anything from Almanac, pumpkin pie, barley wine, aged in brandy barrels, yes please. So let me get this one into a glass, let you guys know how it smells, tastes, and give the final verdict on the Almanac Heirloom Pumpkin Barley Wine. All right guys, so the aroma on the Heirloom Pumpkin Barley Wine. Oh wow, big phenolic alcohol notes, cinnamon, nutmeg, ginger. Big caramel, toffee, a big kind of brandy, that brandy kind of fruity sweetness in there, a little bit of oakiness. Just an absolutely intense smelling beer. Huge stuff. Our guess of the taste on the heirloom pumpkin barley wine. Cheers. Whoa! Right the front of the tongue. Holy cow. Massive sweetness, a big a kind of phenolic alcohol, uh, banana, clovey type of sweetness, middle of the mouth, lots of pumpkin pie spice, ginger, cloves, cinnamon, uh, lots of caramel, toffee, a little bit of oakiness in there, that big kind of brandy sweetness, just almost overwhelming the palate, um, but it really blends nicely with that spiciness that you expect in like a pumpkin pie type of beer, a pumpkin, quote unquote, pumpkin beer, you know, that cinnamon, ginger, nutmeg really helps to cut some of that sweetness, really sweet aftertaste, in the aftertaste, I'm getting cinnamon, nutmeg, again, ginger, clove, more caramel, toffee, big kind of brandy sweetness. It's a vanilla kind of oaky sweetness that just kind of like coats the mouth. It kind of plays off the spices a little bit. You definitely taste the alcohol in this one at 12%. You get the burn. You taste kind of these ethyl kind of sweet alcohol notes playing again off the spiciness. You know, it's really a really, really intense beer, kind of a almost over the top beer, but at the same time, it's really well crafted. Just a really interesting, awesome, solid, slash confusing, delicious, great stuff. All right guys, so the final verdict on the Heirloom Pumpkin Barley Wine, coming in at 12% alcohol by volume from Almanac Brewing. If you guys can get it, definitely pick this one up, guys. This one is getting an A- minus for me. This is one of the most interesting pumpkin beers I've ever had. It's definitely a pumpkin beer, but it's a big kind of arrogant bastard, for lack of a better word. You know, there's a lot going on. This, the, the brandy barrel it just adds this whole another level of complexity, a lot of sweetness, a lot of booziness. You know, you definitely get the pumpkin pie spiciness, but you get that barley wine. It's, it's an English barley wine kind of characteristic, big toffee, caramel, just blending and playing off the spiciness and the alcohol and the oakiness. It's just a crazy, crazy beer. And it's definitely not an entry level pumpkin beer at all. It's definitely one of those beer geek beers um, that you just kind of want to sit down and kind of discuss with people. It's a huge beer. Awesome, awesome stuff, and one of the most interesting pumpkin beers I've ever had, and definitely gonna share this one with some other guys, because it's big. So with that said, getting an A- from me, and awesome stuff. So with that said, remember, life's too short, drink amazing beers. Cheers.